first step to find the square root is we have to start pairing up the number from the right side so we have zeros they form one pair and the next pair we have only one single digit which is 9 now we have to find the divisor divisor will keep changing in a division method for new dividend we get new divisor for the first one we have to find a number whose square is equals to 9 or less than 9 we know that 9 is a square number perfect square number and 3 square is equals to 9 so we'll write 3 times 3 is 9 subtract we get 0 right now we'll drop the next pair which is 0 0 now we have 0 here so we cannot stop here we have 0 we have to solve this too now think of a number uh, like uh, like we have zeros right we have to find a new divisor now this is a new dividend zeros so for this we have to find the new dividend uh, sorry new divisor so how to find the new divisor the number we have in the question we have to take the twice of that or double of that so 3 square or 3 plus 3 is 6 we get 6 now along with the 6 we have to find one more number such a way that this number in the units place of divisor and the number here in the question the next number in the question should be same so if I take 1 here I should take 1 here so this will be like 61 times 1 which is 61 like this so I cannot take like 62 times 3 now this will not give us the required answer so then this number and this number should be same now here in this case we have only zeros right so think of a number which will give us 0 it will be 0 right 0 times 0 is 0 so here if I take 0 that is 60 times 0 will give us 0 so here the number in the divisor will be 0 and the next number in the question will also be a 0 so we get 30 in the question is 0 so 0 minus 0 is 0 right so don't stop at this stage because we have dropped the number here which means we have to solve this part too so we got 0 as a remainder so therefore square root of 900 is equals to 30 number we obtained in the question will be the answer so that's it I hope this question is helpful and I hope you understood the question how to find the square root if you have further question or doubt you can drop a comment thank you so much for watching